little over two years ago when this all started with more than 200 nations staking their claim to be top of the world. Well, 32 made it to the finals here, and after a tournament spanning the better part of a month, featuring endless football on almost every day, it is a straight fight now for the title of the world's best. It has been a great festival of friendship, of sportsmanship so far, and one, we hope, which will end with a flourish. Well, it is, of course, a venue that requires little by way of introduction. It is Celtic Park, affectionately known as Parkhead. The national anthem of Argentina rings out. Well, you do wonder what might be going through the minds of these players ahead of this game of games, the very pinnacle of the world game. Well, when it's this big, Peter, you're having an extra word with yourself in trying to ensure you make the best start you possibly can. Do your bit for the team without any mistakes. We've seen that tense edge during the lineup. So start as you mean to go on strongly. Well, if you did just miss it, we are up and running already. As with a lot of finals. And Martinez! Goal! Argentina! Could that be the start of something big? Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Argentina take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Well, Peter, the emphasis should now switch to winning it, rather than even thinking about losing it. Koke has got himself a free kick. Saul, great strength, too strong for his opponent. Pereira goes looking. Promising move that good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Looks to set one up. Keeper has beaten it away. Messi tries to get it forward quickly. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. It's not taken him long, and that's going to be a booking. Celso and it's Messi. Messi! Oh, denied brilliantly! Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Spain are experts at this stylish possession based game. It's Rodrigo! Oh, that was no routine save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class weight. Hoists it forward. Room for a shot. Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right, and he couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock-solid. Pavon. Di Maria has a pop. It's come back out. He scores. Two up and threatening to pull clear. De Gea did well the first time. Nothing he could do about the follow-up. That's just great play, Peter. A textbook example for any wannabe footballers out there on positioning and movement.
Argentina take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, with this kind of authority, Peter, why not push on and, and totally kill this off? Nacho. Sergio Ramos. And it's played forward. Suso. Done very well to intervene. Messi. Has he picked him out? Messi. He's got away. Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. Sergio Ramos did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Goes for goal! He's got a goal! Just one goal in it now! Game up! The understanding between those two plays a big part in that, and releasing the run on side proved the key ingredient. We have got ourselves a game here. Well, it was important they didn't get ahead of themselves and lose their discipline. This game plan could near well reward them with an equaliser. Tries to dink it in. Big chance, corner. We've played it short. has got rid of that. Argentina are in control here on the brink of half-time. Up towards the front line. Oh, that had to be more accurate. Pereira. Forward it goes. was good pressing, forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. Sergio Ramos. And here's Rodrigo. Rodrigo really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. Pavon. Messi. Di Maria. Looking to get within range. Well, there's the whistle. The first half of the final has flown by. So do more of what we saw as we approached half time. Argentina leading by one in a finely poised game. It is intriguing to watch. It could easily go either way. And the game has already resumed here. Saul tried to play it through. Look, he's offering an apology to his teammate, who's clearly miffed at not being picked out despite making what looked like the right run. But Mendy battles to win it back. That has put a stop to that. It's wrestled off the ball. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. He gets the ticking off and needs to be very careful now. And it's been taken straight back. Pavon goes looking. And that's put paid to a promising move. Lo Celso. Di Maria. Got a sight of goal here. Di Maria showed plenty of zest in getting to the ball, but couldn't quite sort it out. Well, no doubt someone is being given special treatment here. Well, his stealth has been compromised because of his goal, and his treatment from here looks as if it could get a little tighter. 
Well waited. That's Rodrigo. He's had a goal! It's a goal! Oh, that was a cracking little exchange to set up the finish. And a lovely understanding between both players. I mean, that's clearly tailored on the training ground and delivered beautifully on match day. This has become one superb game of football. Well, this is just fantastic, Peter. I think we all got the final we wanted. Um, we can all now enjoy it for what it is. This is just a great game of football. Oh, good interception. Pavon is steaming forward. Messi is on to it and can take it up. Jordi Alba simply had to make that count, and he did it with some authority too. Wonderful. Martinez. Martinez! Goal! Argentina! And again they hit the front. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out. Never mind one. It was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. He's made it three, quite a day at the office for him. This is one of the best performances I've seen in a while. He's practically taken on this team single-handedly, and they don't know how to stop him. Argentina take the lead. Well, from such a showpiece final as well, I think this is exactly the type of excitement that all the neutrals would have wanted on show. There's so many twists and turns in this game, it's a pleasure to watch. Rodrigo. Big chance! Dispatched clinically! Again, we are level! What a contest! Sergio Ramos, very cleverly provided a return ball there and it made all the difference in the creation of that goal. I don't want to take anything away from the finish, but the pass was really good. We have ourselves a real game here. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal. They just got caught napping. He's one on one, surely! He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. He's come loose. Pavon. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Saul. It's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. Ah, oh, now some movement on the bench, and we are going to see a change. Out to the left it goes. He's gone for it! And somehow he managed to miss it. Well, we could be headed for a scenario in which next goal is the winner. That chance could have been it too. Pavon. Well, what about it? Extraordinarily, they have been denied as late and as dramatically as can be. Roberto can hoist it clear. Messi plays it short. Concentration levels. Well, that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is. Messi. 
It's got through to him. Now it's Messi. Messi. And Messi! Goal! Argentina! And they've got their lead back. And that really is so, so impressive. That's always a great sight, you know, on a football pitch. Nimble footage, show great balance and a really cool head to finish. And that kind of dribble is really smart. Argentina get themselves into the lead. Well, that's the currency he deals in, and he's come good yet again. Never the one to let you down in these situations. A tremendous attempt to clearance. Jordi Alba plays it forward. Spain need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. Martinez. <laughs> Referee's given a throw. It's a stoppage time, whistle due any moment. Almost there, and the players can feel it. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Nacho tries to get it forward quickly. And, it's been... and that's it. Argentina are the champions of the world. Football's ultimate prize. This is utopia. What a moment this is for all connected with the team. It's a day for pride, a day for glory. Another grand chapter to be added to their glittering history.